importantly, and because of that, I love. So my last year, you guys are going to see a wall. All the names on this wall, these are all the Dodgers that have ever played for the Dodgers. Up until 2004, so no, Manny Ramirez's name is not on the wall. But there's no one ever going to be able to fly, shape, box, color, or play for them. Anyone's name on the wall, except for one individual, and that's Jackie Robinson. The only consideration the artist was given was to make sure that Jackie's name was put directly in the center of the wall. And each of the balls represents a no hitter thrown by a Dodger. Oh, aquí se ponen a ver el Sí. En vez de ir a ver el World Series, ¿no? So right here you guys see our World Series championship. No viene a ver el partido. Sí. Como si se puede. Well, prior to 1967, the modern day trophy that you see there, which is known as the Commissioner's Trophy, they used to not give those out as World Series trophies. They used to give out those bats as World Series trophies. So the four bats that you see in gold are actually the real World Series trophies. The one on top in green, the reason it's in green, is it's an unofficial official World Series trophy that Tommy Lasorda actually had Louisville commissioned to make uh, for him, uh, to honor the olden times and whatnot. Uh, the modern day trophy, ladies, if you care at all, is actually made over at Tiffany & Co. And no, it does not arrive in a turquoise box with a bunch of crap around. <laughs> Next will be a Gil Hodges jersey. Gil Hodges is probably the next Dodger to be retired in the Dodger Hall of Fame. We're working really hard on making that happen. It's just coming up a little shortly. <coughs> uh, well, if you think about inflation, though, those are still on. Miren los tickets. Miren la base. Mm-hmm. Right. Right here you guys are going to see our uh, 1965 World Series championship play case. The silver play that you see in the center there, that was actually given to Captain P.B. Reese by our teammates that has an engraving of each of their signatures on it. You got Jackie's name on there, Sandy Kofaxes, Don Drysdale, uh, Duke Snyder. Very, very uh, worthwhile play to get your hands on. So after that, uh, that ball is actually the last ball ever uh, used in the 55 World Series. It was the ball that recorded the last out. And it has everyone's signature from the 1955 World Series team on it. Jackie Robinson's name, again, is right up on top. And to the left of that, you're going to see a 1955 World Series ring. Uh, 14 karat white gold and uh, pretty, pretty pricey. You see some bling on that. Uh, who was an MVP way back in the day. And you also see a pair of Roy Campanella shin guards. Roy Campanella was a three-time MVP with the Dodgers in 1951, 1953, and 1955. Um, he was very tragically uh, injured in a car accident on the move from Brooklyn to Los Angeles and actually lost the use of his leg. Um, it was kind of sad because he actually had probably a little bit more left to give to the game. We got gold, silver, and bronze medals uh, from the Olympic Games that we were talking about earlier, the 84 games. These are the actual medals they gave to the finishing respective place team. And right here you're going to see a stage-by-stage -stage process of how a piece of wood is actually spun into a wooden bat over at Louisville Slugger. To my left here you're going to see a lot of uh, different pictures. Uh, the pictures on that wall are all different uh, figureheads and celebrities throughout Dodger history. You guys might see one person in, uh, in uh, this stand out a little bit though. Anyone see it? Who? Come on, I know someone knows. What, what, who's the one guy that stands out over there? Pat Lodge, YG in a Brooklyn Dodgers uniform. It is Babe Ruth. That's Babe Ruth. Over here. A lot of people don't know, in 1938, in 1938, Babe Ruth was a first base coach for the Dodgers. He coached that whole team as a first base coach. Oh yeah, that's, is that just before he went to the 
Oh, no, 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 no. Babe Ruth went from the Red Sox to the Yankees, then he played one year with the Boston Braves, and then he played, uh, then he was out of the game for about two years and came back as the first base coach for the Dodgers. <laughs> Each of the commissioner's trophies are worth approximately thirty thousand dollars, and they all are sorry twenty five thousand dollars, and they weigh approximately thirty pounds. Wow. <laughs> yeah, so they're.